Hello guys, today we're going to be doing a video on Elden Ring's new patch, patch 1.04 with DRTX 3060 Ti. We're running a Ryzen 3700X with 32GB of RAM running at 3200MHz. Alright, let's jump into the settings. We're going to be starting it off with 1080p low. So the main purpose of this video is to see if the stuttering has been fixed and same with the FPS drops that was happening in certain, in certain scenarios. And so far it looks like we're doing pretty good. Not really seeing any lag spikes or any stuttering at all. Holding a consistent 60. The game's using up one or two cores, it seems like. What was it, core three or four? Was spiking up into the 80s. Yeah, core three is spiking up into the high 70s, up to the high 80s. But it seems like either this patch or the one before it has actually has fixed the stuttering in this area. I've gone ahead and switched over to the 5900X system with a 3080. Uh, because I forgot to test this one last situation with the Tree Sentinel, so I'm gonna do it now. Now, even with a 3080, we would get 30 FPS, 35 FPS, while he was dashing around and you were fighting him. So, I just want to go ahead and see if this is true or if this has actually been fixed with this patch. And so far, it looks like we're holding a consistent 60 FPS. We are getting some dips into the high 50s very occasionally, but this is way better than playing in the mid-30s to mid-40s. That was pretty much unplayable. You could obviously still beat him, but it wasn't ideal. But it looks like it's been fixed so far. Now, if this goes smoothly and we don't get any FPS drops, what I want to do is I want to go ahead and start a new save and go ahead and fight a dragon. Because the dragons were another thing that would cause us to consistently have FPS drops and fall into the mid-40s and even the 30s sometimes. But it looks like just playing generally in this in this area, no FPS drops at all, no stutters. It's running on a, a fresh account or a fresh character. We just saw our CPU spike into the 100 CPU Core 3. to hit 100% usage, but FPS was still at 60, so we're still chilling. I didn't feel any stutters either. Uh, now let's go ahead and fight this dragon over here. I haven't actually fought him on this character yet, and. We'll see if this is actually truly fixed. Now, if we run into a GPU bottleneck, then at that point I'll drop the settings down to medium and fight him again. Do a dragon's here. I'm right, gonna wait for him to breathe fire, and we'll see. Here we go. I should just lock onto him. Would be better, huh? Is he gonna breathe fire or? There we go, here we go. Wow, we're holding a consistent. Okay, we did fall into the into the fifties, the mid fifties, but GP was also in the mid nineties, right? So well, let's try it again. Let's try it again, see if we actually get GP bottleneck. Let's go away from him to breathe fire again, and I'll look directly at it. Nah, we lost 2 FPS there. Didn't feel any lag either. So with a 3080, during this fight, so you would fall into the mid-30s to mid-40s. It didn't matter what preset you were playing on. Just the dragons would cause you to lose all your frames. So we're back on the main character, and I want to go ahead and test this out again with the second dragon. And see if this is actually truly fixed. So this should apply to 440p and 4K as well. You just won't see any of those stutters anymore. There's times where it feels like it's lagging and it's, it feels like it's stuttering, but I look at the frame rate and it's holding 60, so it's kind of kind of rough, but it feels really good like 90% of the time there now. There should be a dragon coming up here. There we go. Now let's see. This, this would easily make me fall into the mid 40s on a 3080. As you can see, every time that we fall into the mid 50s or low 50s, our GPU is sitting around. 94%, 93%, so it's pretty much maxed out. Okay, that's not fair. Yep, no FPS drops at all looking at the fire. Okay, it looks like, so far anyway, that the FPS issues have been fixed. These are the two main areas where I would consistently see FPS drops into the mid-40s and mid-30s, no matter the system I was playing on. Oh, there we go, we actually, whoa, we actually got the FPS drop. We actually fit in. We actually fell into the mid 40s when 
It was breathing fire into the trees. So let's go ahead and try it again. That was interesting. That was like a one-off thing where we actually did fall into the mid 40s. So I guess it's not perfect. It's not fully fixed. Oh, this would definitely cause us to have an FPS shot, right? Yeah. So it seems like it's not as consistent with the FPS drops, but it still does happen. Especially with the dragons. The spawn area has definitely been fixed. It doesn't have any stutters anymore there. But dragons, they still do cause FPS drops, but it's not as consistent as how as it was before. And it's not a CPU issue. We saw our CPU wasn't maxed out during the fight. And GP wasn't maxed out either. It was sitting in the 70s, 70% usage. But yeah. I think I'll end the video here guys, I hope you enjoyed it, I hope you found it useful, if you did give it a like, and that subscription would be highly appreciate it. See you next time.